Hey friends, it's Lisa. Welcome and thank you for watching another one of my videos. So today's video, I am sharing some candles that are new to my collection that I bought over the last month or so from Forever Mood. <laughs> He's coming. He's coming. There he is. I knew he was coming. I can hear him. I can hear you. Uh, Milo also just wanted to say hi. He wants to say happy holidays. Yeah. Is that, is that it? Yeah. So anyway, I bought both of these candle sets that I'm going to share during the Sephora VIB sale that happened back in November. So I bought one of them physically in a store when I was getting 10% off because I was a beauty insider. That particular store purchase allowed me to go over the threshold to go into VIB. And so the second collection of candles that I have to show today were actually bought on Sephora's website at 15% off. But you can also, of course, buy them via the actual website of Forever Mood Candles. Now, Forever Mood is the candle company of Jackie Ina, who is a beauty YouTuber slash content creator and candle company owner, entrepreneur. So I am excited because this is my first experience with Forever Mood. I have not burned these candles yet. So everything that I'm gonna be showing today is going to be on cold. And I did open them when I bought them. I'm giving Milo an ear massage and he's just in heaven right now. So I feel like I can't not stop. Like I feel like I can't stop. So that's what's happening over here. He's just, he's just very happy. Oh, okay. There you go. All right. So the first one I bought was the core collection and it came in a box like this. I actually took the candles out already, but uh, you open this magnetic. Oh my God. Okay. The first time I, I opened this box, it took me about 10 seconds to figure out how to open it, but there's a magnetic flap on the bottom. You would open it up and all four candles sit in this box. And this core collection feels very much like a very sweet, maybe bakery inspired collection, uh, but it comes with four 2.5 ounce votive candles. The second collection that I'm going to share with you is the Forever Mood Send Moods. And it's a much more, um, what I would think is like sensual, um, kind of like warm and cozy type of vibe versus the bakery vibe that I got off of the first. But this is also a four 2.5 ounce votive candle set. So the scent, uh, the core collection that is in this box contains four candles. Um, they're 70 grams as well. I forgot to, no, I said 2.5 ounce. So that's that 70 ounces. They come in caked up left on red cuffing season and matcha business those are the names of the four candles and so i have the four candles here they're very beautiful they're in these frosted glass votives and they're very sweet smelling so this first one that i have is caked up and it has top notes of roast, roasted pistachio almond cream and pineapple heart notes which is what i would consider the mid notes of honey jasmine and coconut and the base notes of vanilla bean and musk the second candle that we have here is left on red and the top notes of this one are tropical fruit the heart notes are coconut and coconut milk and the base notes are caramel the third candle we have is cuffing season and this has top notes of fresh ozone, salty lemon, mineral citrus, heart notes of iris, violet, and jasmine, and base notes of Douglas fir, rainforest moss, and white cedar. The last one we have is matcha business. And it has top notes of uh, hazelnut coffee, almond milk, honey, heart notes of coffee and lavender, and base notes of vanilla. So on cold, they're, they're pretty nondescript. Um, I don't mean that in a bad way. I just mean like some of the candles that I've been smelling 
um, recently on cold have been super over the top strong. And not that that's good or bad, it's just what it is. These I'm definitely interested in burning to get a better experience of a, a better familiarity with these candles. I'm not getting in uh, a lot on cold and I'm not like, oh my God, I love them or oh my God, I hate them. Like I'm just kind of at this point, very neutral. I'm very, I'm anticipating that I'll like the candles, but I just want to of course burn them and see what, you know, I like about them. I feel like I'm probably coming off as just kind of like about these, but I actually already filmed this and then my, I had to refilm it. And so now I'm just kind of like, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say at this point. This is also the second video that I filmed today and I don't know, maybe I just didn't have enough coffee today. So I need more energy. The next thing I have are the Send Moods collection. And again, this is for 2.5 ounce or 70 grams worth of votive candles. Now this is in a little bit of a different packaging. It also has a magnetic flap, which I have learned recently that magnetic flaps and I are, <laughs> it seems so simple but at the same time, I'm, I'm horrible. So you get this box, it says open to get lit, get it. And then says in your kitchen, in your bedroom, or in your bathroom, you decide XOXO Jackie Ina. And it comes in these beautiful nude ombre colored votives. Now the one thing I will say about this, and this has nothing to do, I bought this at Sephora, but it's not necessarily Sephora. It's just kind of like a glitch, I guess. I got two of the Hey Big Head instead of one hey big head one skinny dipping so i could have taken this back to sephora i could have exchanged it i just honestly did not want to uh the sephora is near me physically they're not that close there's one close to my work but i work near one of the largest malls in the united states of america and i mean you could google that if you want and you can try to figure it out but uh, the idea of going to a mall at Christmas, anytime <laughs> between Thanksgiving and Christmas, makes me want to throw up. I just, the whole idea of shopping when there's that many people normally gives me anxiety. And then you're like, hey, we have Omicron. I'm like, no, 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 that's cool. I don't want to go to the mall. So like, I didn't want to go to the mall to return these. Uh, and I didn't know if I really wanted to go through the whole like packaging it up and trying to send it back via the mail. So I was thinking, I'm just gonna keep this. I'm sure skinny dipping is delightful, but uh, it wasn't really worth my, my time and my anxiety to like go to the mall, go back to FedEx or UPS. So I'm just gonna keep the way it is. But you get, hey big head, we're not LinkedIn, grown folk business and the one I don't have, which is skinny dipping. So, hey big head, hey big head. I just don't know like all the hidden meetings behind the titles, if there are hidden meetings, hidden meeting, meetings, hidden meetings, oh my gosh, hidden meanings. Um, hey big head has roasted coffee as their top note, heart notes of sweet toffee and hazelnut, and base notes of vanilla. So right off the top, these notes, I mean, I know Matcha Business had some coffee, but I feel like these are like darker, like a little more heavier scents, at least on this one. And maybe because I have two of the same candle, that is probably the strongest smelling candle. It just makes me think that this is like more of a, like that's light. Like I think of like Marie Antoinette and French macarons with this one in terms of like the whole aesthetic and this is like warm. Oh, I didn't even notice. It's an ombre colored box as well. Oh, sugar, look at that. Okay, dark here was the darkest candle and then it would move over and it gets lighter and then in theory, oh, Jackie, girl, I got you. I like that. Um, So yeah, so that's that we have we not LinkedIn, which by the way, I mean, LinkedIn is such a weird, I have, I have a really hard time getting these things out of the packaging. Does anyone use LinkedIn? I mean, I know for, for professional reasons, but it's like, I just, 
I see some of the posts on there and I just don't have it in me to write like a LinkedIn worthy post on my LinkedIn. So, oh my God, okay. All right, we not LinkedIn. This one is pumpkin, cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg. The pumpkin was the top note, cinnamon, ginger, and nutmeg were the heart notes and base is whipped cream and tonka. I get a little bit of like the nutmeggy smell but on cold, I'm not really getting anything else on this, but I definitely feel like that would be like a, a fall, winter type of scent to burn. That's the other thing too, kind of going like the core collection, I could see myself burning that and invoking like spring. And it could be just like with the colors, the packaging, this is like, I'm not going anywhere for the next X amount of months until spring. I'm gonna burn these and get all cozy in my, just cozy in my space. The next one I have is Grown Folk Business, which is top notes of herbal moss, white clove, cool mint, heart notes of gray cedar, velveteer, patchouli, yang yang and base notes of amber, rosewood, and vanilla. I feel like on cold, this one is the one that I'm, out of this collection, I'm the most excited to burn. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned it before, but I'm out of the other collection, Cuffing Season is like the one I'm like super excited for. But I think out of this collection, Grown Folk Business is the one that I am most excited for. And Skinny Dipped, which is the one that I don't have because as I said, I received two of the Hey Big Head and uh, in place of one of each, Skinny Dipped has top notes of pistachio, almond cream, apple, heart notes of nutmeg, clove, coconut, and base notes of vanilla and tonka. I would have loved to smell that one. Uh, maybe I can buy that one. If I if I like these candles, maybe I can buy that one next. It's just like an individual candle if it's available. So, but yeah, I mean, that smells amazing with those notes. Those were the two collections that I bought from Forever Mood from Sephora, but you can also buy them directly from Forever Mood's website, along with tons of other candles. Uh, Forever Mood has multiple collections, and they also sell, these are just the small size that come in the collections. They have larger size candles that you can buy individually. I think they're like $38 a piece if you're gonna buy the individual candles. These, I will find how much they were and I will write them either in the description box or I will put it on the screen. So those were the candles that I bought from the Forever Mode collections from Sephora. If you liked this video or found any of the information helpful, please think about giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing. Until next time guys, I hope you all stay off. Bye.